Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of the Shadows of Mordor. Alright, when we left off, we did not have this many people identified on the field because I did a little bit of hunting off screen for intel people. And uh, I managed to do it rather quickly and I'll show you how quickly I managed to do it in just a second. First, I wanted to show you this guy, Nazkuga Fleshrot, who is actually nearby. Uh, Apparently has a weakness to stealth finishers uh, and a fear of Karagors and Grogs, but he is invulnerable to ranged and a monster slayer, which is weird that he has a fear of Karagors when he can also kill them rather quickly. I still find that odd. But, anyway, with that said, we can also go to this guy, who is quite a looker, Tumhorn, uh, what was his name, the Rash. Yeah, that, that, I, I would assume that's a Rash something allergic reaction anyway that face notwithstanding uh, apparently he has a vulnerability to stealth finishers and damaged by combat finishers but he's invulnerable to range hen hates caragors which makes sense because he's also a monster slayer now we have a couple other ones this guy whose weapons are apparently coated in blood yeah a lot of blood holy shit <laughs> savage weapon that explains it Alright, well, um, other than that, he does have a fear of Karagors, and he's damaged by combat finishers, but he's invulnerable to stealth and ranged, but he does not have the ability to slay monsters quickly, which means if I'm using a Karagor, I can go after him. More or less. And then this guy, Kuthug Bowmaster, who is, in vul who is vulnerable to mounted beasts and damaged by combat finishers, but invulnerable to ranged, but also not able to kill monsters quickly, so I can easily kill him with a mounted beast, mainly a Karagor. Apparently his master is uh, Fulgum the Drunk. I guess he was one of the last bodyguards he had. Oh, wait, nope, he had another one, which was Mosvel Eye Goucher. That's a name. Okay, Uthug still doesn't have a bodyguard. Oh, well. That is fine. Anyway, I just wanted to show you the ones I managed to learn intel about, and you're probably wondering how I managed to do it so quickly. Well, because I was on this guy the entire time. Well, more or less, for a good third of it. Uh, apparently, if you have him under your control, you can just dismount him, and he'll do his own thing for a little bit. As long as he's under your control, you can do whatever. You can dismount him just to kill uh, whatever is in your path. It's completely and utterly fine. Oh, wait. Is that... Nas That's our guy. That's our guy. Alrighty. Let's see if we can incite the, uh... fear of Karagors here. Oh! There goes the monster slayer. Oh, hey there! No idea the bother's coming to you. Forges are spouting. Towers are building. Weapons are forging. Wolves are coming! Alright, if you say so. But, for right now... Okay. I'm just gonna be dealing with you. That's all I need to do. Get some good damage there. Woo! Add a little extra. There we go. Come on. Perfect. And kill this guy, because he's gonna be a problem soon. Knock you around. And you're gone. Perfect. Alright, well, that didn't go exactly how I expected, but hey, it worked out. Unfortunately, it killed my mount, but hey, I can get those a dime a dozen. You did well, though, buddy. I'll give you that much. Alrighty. Onward we go. Oh, there's a grog over there. I forgot to mention that, but I'm not going anywhere near him. I've learned my lesson a million times over. Alrighty. Now, with all that said and done, I think, yeah, this is for Mog the Screamer. Again, he's doing more stuff for uh, Ookbook, even though I put a death threat against him. Uh, speaking of, where is his stuff? Uh, his is all the way over on that side. I'll have to deal with that eventually. But for now, because this guy is closer, I'm going to be dealing with Mog, because I still haven't killed him yet. <laughs> Still not yet. But that will be fixed soon. 
fairly soon. Oh wait, I should look at the rune I picked up. Probably. Yeah. It. Yeah, Sylvan Arrow. It's a level 13. It's pretty much the same as I got currently. Yeah, so break that down. It's pretty much exactly the same, so there's no point. And it doesn't stack either, I don't think. So, there's really no point. Okay, that was weird to listen to. Alright, what do we got over here? A whole bunch of shield people that can easily be blown the fuck up. <laughs> or not. Well, at least most of them did. But still, let's just get ourselves moving a little bit. There we go. Run quickly. There we go. And get some intel out of you. You really should. There we go. Alright, we got a couple last ones here. Bulg the Fearless. Hmm. Satisfied by the way the Black Captain killed another orc. Well, apparently they're fairly close. Uh, damaged by explosions and combat finishers. Alrighty. He's gonna be a tough one. There we go. Good stuff. And let's go get this one done. Alrighty. Mog. Gotta deal with you. Alright. And damaged by explosions. I never checked. Eat, drink. Pass out! Okay, well, that's rather specific. And... Kaboom! <laughs> and... Some good damage. Yeah! You should have stayed dead the first time. How about no? How about I kill you instead? Like that. Or, like this. That looked like it hurt. Feast resolved. Dead. Oh! Is that an epic rune I spawned? Nobody can move like that! I think I do. You die as you lived. Cold as stone. Increases it's stun dark. and knockdown effects. Wasn't able to read that entirely before it left. That's fine. You're gone. Perfect. Let's get moving. So I can actually look at the fucking rune. There we go. What do we got? was... There we are. Cold as stone. Increases stun and knockdown durations on countered enemies by 50%. Hmm. That'd be decent, but it's not worth me throwing it on. Especially when I could easily throw that on. Hmm. Yeah. It, it, I'd, it'd be more worthwhile to grab that Oh, I can convert these. Ow. Shit. I didn't realize that. Some of these I can convert if I'm not going to use them. This one I can't. Because this one came with the game. <laughs> Some of them came with the game, so I can't do that. But others that did not, I got from uh, Uruk Captains, which some of them are not showing for some reason. I can easily just break these down. Alright. I can break this down, for sure. Um, double the normal rate. I don't need that that much, actually. So, I'll just get rid of those two. Alrighty. Perfect. That worked out beautifully, I think. Uh, I don't want to do this one. I kind of really don't want to. Uh, what can I do instead? Oh, I know. Deal with Ookbook. Finally. Because I've been putting that off for far too long. Alright. Wow, he's a long way away. Okay, well, this is going to be a trek. And a half. And three quarters. Okay. Up we go. Perfect. And thus far, I'm not seeing many Uruks. That's weird. Considering. Huh. Onward we go. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, there's not a lot of them over here. Oh, the internment camp. Okay. I figured it was near a uh, little stronghold. And usually they are, so that makes sense. 
Alright. Let's get rid of this guy. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh. Ooh. That one looked like it hurt. Can I get this little artifact that's around here? I think it's in here, so maybe? There it is. I'm not, I was just trying to pick up an artifact on my way there, because why not? There we go. Not old Scorchy is a common refrain among the orcs of Udun. It is interesting to note that while branding with red hot irons as punishment it is commonplace, with the orcs searing their flesh searing the flesh of their unruly brethren as much as they do their slaves, old Scorchy is unique, used only on the most recalcitrant. Yeesh. Uh, the orcs believe Scorchy holds sorcerer's powers, enabling it to burn longer and hotter and to scorch with such intensity the pain can be felt for weeks after the branding. Good gods. All right, you. You're not so brave now, are you? Hold him, boys. Get your filthy hands off me! It's simple, see? Do unto others quicker and harder than they do unto you. But at least you tried. Next time, try harder. This is going to hurt a lot. But you'll learn who's in charge. No! Not, not old Scorchy! Anything but old Scorchy! Yeesh. That was disturbing. That was fairly disturbing. Okay, we can buy some attributes. Uh, we can buy a bow rune slot or a dagger rune slot. Uh, which one has a good rune that I wanted to put on? Uh, this one has that one. Which is pretty damn good. Um, is there anything particularly good on this one? Uh, no? No. No, not really. Yeah, there wasn't really particularly anything good on the dagger. At least not right now, so... I guess I can get it on the bow. Alright. In that case, there we go. Perfect. And... There's the last rune. Alright. Alright. And the one I wanted was this one. Because while I get uh, 10 health on a headshot kill, I get 5 just for a kill in general. For, with, for about the same sort of percentage chance. I think that's pretty good. Alrighty. And with that done, I can get have out a twisted here. concept of justice? It is Ooh, not yeah. justice. It is the constant weeding out of the weak in favor of the strong. Yeah, that sounds about right. And goodbye. Good stuff. Alright. Oh, there's some intel over here. I don't know if I can do it quickly and quietly. I might be able. What thoughts give you strength? The satisfaction of crushing all this weak and feeble. Okay. There we go. I got it. And I might be able to learn about the last guy. There we go. Oh. Say last guy. Apparently two more came up. Duh. There we go. Stakuga the Torturer. Okay. That is, that is a face. Irked by the constant buzzing of nearby more guy flies. Well, that's your own fault, isn't it? Okay. Vulnerable to combat finishers and mounted beasts. Hates ghouls. Okay. He's pretty easy to take care of. That's good. Alright. Let's head over to... Uh, not fuck come on Italian there we go uh, you're right <laughs> you are shockingly right what is this over here I didn't even notice this uh, thrack the ever wounded hmm didn't realize he was right there don't want to deal with him right now but didn't realize he was right there might later you say that. <laughs> That'd be good too. You can't hit Shrock. 
No matter how many shots you get, killing the talk won't be so easy. Well, I mean, that's true. It wouldn't be that easy. Oh, come on. Let me get to the thing. There we go. Because I figured if it's right there, I might as well get it too. Alright. The Rangers of Gondor are not just powerful warriors, they also perform a host of duties throughout the kingdom. Depending on the circumstances, a ranger may be called upon to serve as a mediator, a judge, a medic, and, on occasion, even a teacher. Rangers have been known to carry basic reading primers, and during their stays in villages where opportunities for learning are scant, to select a few favored pupils and show them how to read and write. That's nice. Oh, okay, right on the clasp there. Uh, there we go. Sound it out now. Fear no. Why must you put me through this, Hergon? There's no one to blame but yourself. You begged me to teach you the words in my books. I regret that now. What use is the page here in Mordor? Here, look at this. It's a note for you. My love. Be my knife. Try again. Knife? Wife. Wife? Yes, Hagon. I am yours. Ah, That is adorable. Come on. You gotta say that's adorable. That's the most adorable thing in this wretched hellhole. <laughs> Come on. That's amazing. I love it. 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 Okay. <laughs> Now, with that bit of niceness out of the way, time We've to do given some the murder. the a chance to escape Mordor, to reach the safety of Gondor. And we can draw the eye of our enemy. As long oh, yeah. as we can hold his gaze, we can buy time for Middle-earth. That's true. Deal with this guy. Who decided he wanted to be a hero, and uh, failed. Epically. There we go. Calm down. Challenge Ukbuk Oathbreakers by killing his berserkers. Alrighty, can you? When pawns fall, the king will emerge. Kill the war chief's vanguard. Well, hopefully I can manage to do that. Because, uh, berserkers tend to be a problem for me. But if I manage to get headshots on them, it should be easier. Easy, yes, anyway. There! I see it! Oh, hello! Well, now you're gone. Goodbye. Someone's sneaking about. Okay, well. This guy, if I can anyway. There we go. That's one. Two. Three. Alright. Well, I mean. That somewhat worked out. I gotta kill three of them, so gotta keep an eye for more. And there's a couple of them. Uh, let's blow this up. There we go. That did the rest. Ookbook. If I remember correctly, I have to do ranged with him because otherwise it won't work. Is that right? I wanted to double check. Yeah, because Combat Master makes him invulnerable to everything I can throw at him. Okay, that didn't work. You maggot! Yeah! This is the maggot who said he'd make me suffer, lads. Let's show him what suffering is. Okay, well I have to I have to test this. Okay, geez. Perfect. Perfect. There we go. Okay. That worked out. As long as I can get arrows thrown at him. Come on now. Consistently do arrows. That's all I need to do. Okay, I need more arrows. Shit. Well. Oh, he's retreating. This, and you'll suffer. Lord promised you that. 
Well, you say that, and thus far, I'm starting to think you're wrong. Oh, geez, come on now. I'm not letting you run away. No, you're not getting away this time. Come on. I'm, I can run up here faster than you can. Come on. There we go. You're not running away. That's not going to happen. Come on now. Come on. Come on. You are not getting away this time. Ow, jeez. That's annoying. Okay, come on. Okay, maybe he is. Okay, Jesus. Okay, combat drain. That's what I need to do. Perfect. And... Where is he at? Okay, where is he at? He's over there. It's good that he's within range, at the very least. Oh, come on. Let me hit you. Damn it. There we go. Go. I'm not allowed to do anything like that? Oh, shit. I'm really not. Shit. Okay. Shit. I'm really not allowed to do anything with him, am I? Jesus. Okay. This is not working out in my favor. Okay. Perfect. Kill. And you're gone. Come on. Get some damage on him. But he keeps moving away. Okay. Perfect. I can't... Come on. There we go. Okay. I'm almost... Almost. Almost. Shit. He just keeps running away. I can't really get anywhere. Shit. This is gonna be tough. This guy might... This guy might be impossible for me to beat. Shit. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, I was definitely not expecting that, and I'm dead. Oh, they'll soon call me captain. Well, you'll soon be dead. <sighs> Damn it. It wasn't even the guy killing me. It was the fact that I couldn't get headway. I couldn't get headway against this guy because he was immune to anything else I could throw at him. Bag of Bogue of the Choker died. Okay. All the Fearless are increased. Ah. Crackhorn the Wrestler. Loaded. Shaka Brawl Master. Promoted. Stakuga the Torturer. Promoted. Lugnak the Cruel. Promoted. That was. That's a face. Yeesh. That's just straight up annoying. That was... <laughs> it's like I couldn't get anything else in. He's damaged by explosions and ranged attacks, but... My ranged attacks aren't that good! I guess the problem I kept running into is I was... Kept hitting the button for Shadow Strike Kill instead of Shadow Strike. Because the only thing I can do is just do incremental damage and not, like, complete finishers. <sighs> That's the most aggravating thing. 
Anyway, I'm gonna end the episode here for right now. There's nothing else I can do. That was infuriating, <laughs> to say the least. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community, we can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat, playing games, trying to kill a war chief, and failing because he just cannot be killed easily for you.